Hi YouTubers, it's 40 Clicky 45 LC coming to you in Hot Lead Zone. And today it's Monday night and we're home from work and what better way to start the evening to start the Turbo Tumbler, the Lyman Pro Turbo Tumbler, and get some of the brass that we've been shooting over the weekend or so and get it going. There's what better way to get Monday going than to convert all this range scrap lead that we picked up into nice ingots. So here it is YouTubers. We made 32 pounds of lead ingots and used the Lyman ingot mold that's actually 43 years old and I still have it and it's still cranking out ingot molds. Lyman. So YouTubers, that's an introduction to the topic of tonight's video and that is the Lyman Reloading Handbook. Specifically the 49th edition published in the year 2008 and available now for purchase from all major outlets. So I've been reloading for 43 years and during that whole time the Lyman Reloading Handbook has been with me. It began in the year, two, in the year 1970 with the Lyman Reloading Handbook and in those days there's a limited number of calibers, limited number of powders and components and this was the handbook. Still very useful today. But it's not up to date. And as the shooting sports progressed in the year 1982 I purchased the 46th edition. The publishing was 1982. And you see it's grown more calibers, more components, more to the shooting sports, more powders. And this was very useful. But now the, the 49th edition in the year 2008, look at this volume. Talk about comprehensive. And it has all the latest calibers, including the, including the short magnums, your your big bore calibers this kind of thing so a very comprehensive book twenty two twenty three dollars for a new reloader and by the way Lyman's all about reloading the company Lyman started in 1878 in Connecticut and one of America's oldest companies and its name is synonymous with reloading is Lyman so if you're a new reloader, this book has sections on the procedures for reloading rifle and pistol, the fundamentals, and if you're an experienced reloader, this book is valuable because it actually has information in there that is new. So, For instance, the primers and the making of mercury primers and why they're disadvantageous to us as reloaders, the making of lead stipnate primers and the chemistry behind that, fascinating. And now, now the non-mercuric, non-corrosive primers, the non-lead primers that we have now and what's working with them. So there's, there's new information for experienced reloaders as well. And the reloading data section is full of, of comprehensive information, data that can be used for all the new bullets and cast bullets as well. So, uh, very useful volume. And it begins with a treatise on why even reload in the first place. Well, there's four common reasons. We won't go into those. You know those. But also... There's an, another one now, and that is reloading gives us freedom from supply shortages and being held hostage to high prices. Very good reason to reload today. But then it goes into safety, which is always a very important consideration, followed by the educational training part on reloading rifle and pistol. Talks about components, the brass cartridge case, the powder, the powder charge, the a full uh, section on powders, bullets, and the primers, of course, before going into the reloading data section. 
So YouTubers, if you're looking to round out your library or even make a basis, a basic volume for your reloading data library, the Lyman Reloading Handbook, you can't go wrong. And a lot of us don't give Lyman the credit for, for its major place for us in the reloading hobbies and enthusiasts. So the Lyman book is a, is a great resource. And the company makes a lot of products that we use today, such as the tumbler we saw in the beginning, all the bullet casting gear, the ingot molds, this kind of thing. So look around and you'll see you've got a lot of Lyman stuff already. Bye for now.